Yo, what up, guys? It's your boy, Zach, Z Reality. I uh, want to throw a quick apology out for not posting for a couple weeks. I kind of had some personal family issues to handle. Um, that being said, uh, so I got some information that kind of made me a little confused in understanding the justification. So Michigan has a law where minimum wage is supposed to go up every year with the exception of a few different things that can happen, that can uh, put a stop to that for the year. We'll touch on that in a minute. So in 2020, because of an exception, minimum wage does not go up. So now at the end of 2021, next uh, in January of 22, um, minimum wage is supposed to go up, and it's only going up 20 cents. It hasn't gone up in two years. And so, for the first time in two years, it goes up and it only goes up 20 cents. That almost seems like a spit in the face to me. Two, that exception I was talking about, the one that we hit that caused a minimum wage not to go up, was our unemployment rate was higher than 8.5%. So, what doesn't make sense to me is... If, uh, if you have a problem with unemployment and your rate is high, wouldn't you want to make wages better to entice people to work? I don't see how not raising minimum wage is a solution to that at all. Or how that should stop minimum wage from going up. If you have an unemployment problem and your rate is high, why does it make sense not to stop your yearly minimum wage raises. That makes no sense to me. If you're already having a problem getting people to work, that's going to give them another reason not to. I'm going to start posting more and more. I got a whole bunch of content I got to put out. Again, I apologize for not posting for a few weeks. I really appreciate it if you hit like and subscribe on my uh, videos. And I'll see you next time.